Pass on me, amores. It's me, Horacio. This is my Latin voice. Watch me as I walk away. Esteban? <laughs> and I'm Esteban. ¿Cómo estás? Bien, gracias. Get <laughs> back within the chest. De nada. Uh, real people, real issues, real answers, and real reality. Uh, you can send any question to nhs at gmail.com. Uh, we will answer it if it hasn't been uh, shot already. Our question we bring in, which is number 267, I may be off, but um, don't sue me. Uh, we have some, like, uh, not concerns, but we're speculating that in, jo in Horace's uh, field of line of work, he, he notices uh, quite a bit of um, homeless people on the corner uh, with their signs trying to get donations. And I noticed the same thing well, too. The thing is, like, are all of them really legit? Is it, is it a business now? I mean, I, I don't, this is where I know it's really sensitive topic, but we're just opening open to the issues right here and I'm uh, trying to figure out. Yeah, there's some clues that we noticed that something ain't right here. Something not right. right. Because first, first off, when, when a homeless person has a clean shave and white socks, something ain't right. Clean shave and white socks and then the sign looks like it's, they did that shit up on like on a computer screen. It's like perfectly. <laughs> The pen, the, the, the yeah. ship is ridiculous. <laughs> and um, some of the signs uh, do look like they were done with a sharpie. I mean, last time I checked, last time I checked, a sharpie, a like, decent pack of two is two ninety nine, two twelve. And two twelve, that is two pieces, uh, actually two items at any ninety nine cents value fast food place. Last time I checked, right? Yeah. Because they have. I mean, if I had the choice between. A sharpie, sharpie and a, and a, and a, a, a double chip. I mean, you think about it. Both in the business. Yeah, that's that's that right. money. Would you guys scare the corner or you guys in the back? Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on up. Okay. So, my, uh, another, another thing I noticed the other day, too, um, I was heading home and I was on the um, turnpike exiting, and I saw. Oh, is it transient they call it? Is that transient the clean word for it? Uh, when you're homeless? Uh, uh, Okay, well, homeless. I saw a homeless guy that was on the corner with a sign, you know, saying, you know, he needs some uh, donations for food. He was starving. Oh, man, man. So, so I saw another gentleman that was on the, walking up with another sign towards him. So I'm like, there's going to be a confrontation here because of territory. I thought it was going to be a territorial uh, uh, war here. They went up and started whispering to the ears, and the other guy that was there had another guy in the back and left. And he walked to the side, across the street, to the uh, festival flea market. And I saw him folded his sign neatly and slid it into his uh, this duffel bag. And it's like they switch shift. <laughs> it's like they change shift. And I immediately called Horace. I was like, Horace, you don't what I just saw. I see this guy walk up with a sign saying that he needs food to another guy with a sign. I thought he was going to be like, hey, you on my turf. You know, I'm, uh, you know I've been working this far. you got to go. It wasn't that. It was conversation for a good four minutes, of, you know, and then one guy hit the other guy in the back and tapped him and waved and switched out and he went to his bag and he struck it in there and it went off. So you know, what I, you know what I've noticed too, Steve. It's kind of like the, you know the the, the 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 people that do the newspaper with a homeless thing for help. Yeah. The homeless look like just pop up out of nowhere. It's like you don't see them walking to the destination. You don't see them even drop down by air. You don't see them like driven in. They just like pop up in the middle of the median of a highway. It's like, how the hell? And where did he come from? I didn't even see these people walk this way. I don't, so if now it's not a spec, I'm sort of wondering like, are they being like routed there, dropped right. off? And then it, because it's, I don't see them walking. You don't see nobody like sticking out their finger. That's what you need help. We stick out their finger on the highway on the streets. You need help. These people are asking for help. They are asking for funds. They need signs, clean shaves, white socks. Probably be there. And it's very trouble. I seen a female for the first time. I really see females that much. I saw one and she had a fresh highlight in her hair. It was okay, a okay. Caucasian chick. Like she had no, 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 they do have homes for the homeless. For highlights? Like for homes for the homeless. That they, they go there and they take care of them. Not because you're homeless doesn't mean that you're dirty and stink. No, 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 no. no right? We're not saying that. We're talking so about luxury. I think highlights is highlights. Is highlights is highlights. Is it's a choice that they make that they don't want to take things from their family members or take things from friends and they rather. What's your take on highlights? 
Okay, so I'm gonna take some food that you have. Not because they have white socks and a good fresh cut. It could be a part of whatever they do at the homes that they are. What about a watch? Watch? Yeah, this is a, a, a they had he had a G shot. This guy had a nice G shot. G shot? No, I'm sorry. No, I. It was a G shot. It was a G shot. It was a little rough, but I'll tell you, I was hungry. If I was hungry, I would have fought. I would have fought. I would have fought. my belly. Yeah. Okay. But you would still have to go back in the streets and get some money. What? But the 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 ones that are in the homes, like a home home, they do go out in groups and say, okay, you know, on this. Corner going back oh, and so they bring do. it back to the, but but it's part of them it's a, get, it's a business. getting revenue to, to for them to live. It's a business. It's, but it's for them to live. So they don't. So they don't. They're not homeless on the street, okay. but they don't have an actual residential like you have an address to say this is where I am. Well, so yeah, they so, have so, an actual just say, like a huge home that they go to. So there's different like stages. Orphanage. Yeah. It's like an orphanage. So they have different, so they have different stages of homelessness. <laughs> what do you mean different stages? You have homeless and and, and you got a home maybe. <laughs> maybe. Less, um, maybe. Yeah. Home, yeah. yeah. Home maybe. Probably. Yes. Probably. Yes. Probably. Home less, you ain't got nowhere maybe. to so go. So maybe the, the person that has those little um, vests, you'll see them with the little That's what I'm talking about. They could okay. be so maybe they somebody. will see one in the lower grade homeless vests, like you're yeah, saying. Home and just tell them, hey, you know what? We do have a home I, where I, you can I, come to sure. and join that or, you know, whatever I, the case I, is. I, I'm pretty sure the homeless, I mean, they're regular citizens and just like us, they have the mentality intelligent. So if they had the intelligence, to figure out a way to strategically, okay, guys, let's get together. You do this corner, you do this corner here. So I wonder why they didn't bind themselves together to figure out a way to get them out of that situation. Instead of, instead of, it's the same thing. It's, it's the same thing like um, the, the the system of giving you know of um, food stamps and stuff like that. It's, it's it's just a rinse and repeat. You get the money from the government and you keep going, and that works for them. So this. Homelessness works for them. I, I understand that, and, and I see where you're coming from. But don't say you're homeless, then. But they are homeless. No, they not. don't have no, a home. No, they, no, they have a but cell. But, a cell. but a, if you're an orphanage and you live in an orphanage, does that mean you have a home? You don't. You, you're really just no, staying you're home. No, that mean, you're doing bad. That means you're loved. You're loved. You're not loved in New York. You're not loved. Where are you off of this? Someone's feeding you. Someone's taking care of you. You're taking care of you. You're taking care of you. Someone cares. Yeah. So you don't. So you're not. You're not orphaned. You're not an orphanage. So how do they get money if they don't run back for it? The homeless guys. I'm talking. No. About see that part. I understand. I understand myself. But we need to change the title of homeless. Yeah. Yeah. So they're homeless. To what? Oh baby. Yeah. Part partially. Partially yeah. home. I do. I do. Really, really but bad. I do understand your point where you say you know they um, they do have a business. Or yes, yes. I I have given money to homeless men, and when I look around, they were really not homeless. Yeah. On a serious tip. Yeah. So but, yeah, it but, but it's unfortunate the good has to suffer. Exactly. So there's a little mixing in there, man. Because they oh, when they have that, that that change cup, I seen them take out the, the singles and put them in the pocket yeah, and, and keep the change. Like I ain't getting nothing all day. And they got sixty dollars. But that's just because this is just a mechanism. I mean, so I mean, they don't want it to fall out or Anika, something. Anika, please stop. Please right now. Okay? There's no way in hell you're gonna tell us uh, you gonna tell us uh, oh they don't want it to fall out. No. They don't want nobody to see that there's singles in there. Oh they don't want it. Are they good? No, you wanna take that damn singles out. But that's smart though. Exactly. Exactly. Because exactly. you're homeless doesn't mean that you're not smart. No, I'm not saying that. I'm not that's categorizing and saying that. Saying that but I'm, all I'm saying is that we're confused because the word homeless means so like are, I'm in dire straits. It, does this mean well, that it puts you in a situation where you're not sure if you're supposed to help them? I still, no, I, I still help them. You know, okay. I still give it to them. It's well, just like if it's evident, then I won't. But then on the other hand, I, I tend not to try to judge him. Like, hmm, I wonder if he's hustling me. Let me hold out on this one because I always give it to him because I say I'd rather be wrong, and that uh, I'd rather be. I mean, I'd rather be deceived. Right. And he didn't need it than me held back on my own. That was guy. So that's, I still give it to him. I'm just saying that there's just a few things we've been noticing me and Horace. But I do. And I'm just trying to call them out. No one's really said anything about it. People speculate like, oh, they don't need it. No. But me and Horace is really trying to pimp, pinpoint things that we noticed that make us feel suspicious. People don't want to talk I mean, about that. That's true. What, 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 what really pushed me over the edge is one day when I saw this lady, a Caucasian lady, good looking woman. And what really pissed me off was when she used mascara as dirt to make the put dirt on her face. Know she's it, that was not dirt. It's a certain it color, it's like a bluish color. Yeah, way smeared. Yeah. I'm like, what's going on here? This lady actually put mascara yeah. on her cheeks and her face yeah. for dirt. And she was not, she was, I had all her teeth. Not saying that all homeless people don't have teeth. But she was very healthy looking, very willing. 
And she just worked this highway all the time. And as soon as she popped up, but guess that, what? And guess that what? Doesn't necessarily mean she's homeless. Because I've known no. people that actually stood out there, regular people that have nine to five, stood out there collecting money, See, uh, go uh, jump in their car. And, and, and I was just about to send her. I was just about to send her. I seen that. I seen that her six, seven months later, jump into her car in a in a, in a, um, in a, in a plaza, not too far from there. And I was like, I knew she wasn't homeless. So it's like it's kind of like you know it's kind of deceiving. So I always go off my instincts and somebody look like, you know, they ask for two bears. And that's like, and they say, yeah, that's uh, give me two bears, brother. You know, then I know something going on. Yeah. This brother needs something. Just because you're just sitting out begging for money doesn't mean you're right. Do you think it's best to give them, what since they're homeless, do you think it's best to give them food if you see them as what opposed to give them money? You know what I did last time? I would give them food. As I gave them, them a canister like this of the can. Of, it was from um, it was from Publix. Okay, because I knew the guy was going to be out there. So you know what, I'm going to be prepared for him, you know? I'm gonna get him some general pork and beans, okay? A can of pork and beans, and I got him some fruits, and I understand the fruits, you know, maybe I could inject something with it. But I said, I said, here you go, man. And he's like, what's that? I was like, oh, it's some canned food, man. It's non-perishable. I said, it lasts a little while. And he said, no, I'm okay. I'm like, you okay? I was like, I thought you was collecting because you're hungry. And he said, no, no, I'm okay. I'm like, dude, I mean, it's canned food. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not trying to poison you. He said, I'm okay. And you got some addicts out there. That's, yeah. actually that's, that's, that's what I'm saying. It's like, you know, we, so don't, know, what we don't know what to do. You got addicts, you got face, you got reels. You know, don't know what to do, man. It's like another world. We don't know about that world. No, no. And another occasion I had, I had some spare jeans, a bag, some spare jeans between uh, the, the, the side business. And I was, had them in the car. I had it in the car, right? <laughs> and I had it, I saw the guy at the light, and he had his pants with the shriveled up. Right. So I was like, bro, here you go, man, here's some jeans. And he didn't want to take it. I'm like, this not making any sense, you know? It's a business. Well, it's to make, you can't be it has to be. Yeah, you when, can't, when, when they do that, it's just money. You can't, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, you can't be intimidated by me giving you jeans when you, not, when you have the balls to walk up to anybody's car not knowing what they're going to do. Oh, I know why, Steve. I just thought about it. He's not going to look homeless then. Okay. He's gonna look fashionable. He's like, oh, they don't mind giving up money to wear these raw ass jeans. It's not easy. It's what I said. That's why I scream. Sorry, I mean, I heard a lot of jeans with Fabu on them. And, and I'm on the side of the set. I'll work for food correctly. Exactly. And, 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 and another thing, too, if you're giving them the food, he, he and people see that, they're like, oh, he's good. Yeah, yeah. smell like, yeah. look like yeah. he has spell check. He ain't for the day. I mean, come on. So that's what happened. I understand. I'm, I'm looking for somebody with but the food, I think full of facial it. hair. They can. It's not I'm looking for a guy it's that's like dirty. It's not like they're on the streets. They can put it in. I'm looking for somebody yeah. that, you know, signed at these spell check. I'm looking for all that. Yeah, it smells very well. And yeah. this guy. And the Sharpie thing, I think it's just an investment. Yeah, we're that's, just, that's just an investment. I understand, but there is. I, I, I try to write with no Sharpies, and I cannot get that yeah. straight line. There's three types of Sharpies out there. There's a fine point, regular point, and there's a broad point. The broad right. one is six ninety nine. Yeah, but what I'm saying, that that's an investment in their sign. Yeah, an investment for the business. Uh, so a perpetrator, so perpetrator, 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 yeah. perpetrator homeless. But if he wrote it in a pencil, it'd be very difficult for you guys. I understand that, but the Sharpie is so good. So it's a marker. They, you, right. know, you know, uh, I just figured it out, Steve. I know what they're doing. They're using a stencil kit. Huh? Are you serious? Yes, I'm not. See, these are right stencil now? kits, Steve. So cute. See, this is. <laughs> I'm kidding you. <laughs> no, no. I'm sorry, folks. I'm telling you, if you guys see these oh, signs. Goodness. Try to with a sharp and clean line. These lines are perfect straight. But at least they took the time to put the effort it's into making a great sign. It's a so stencil that kit. Well, check it out. Look at the guy that got his face hit eating off. He, oh. was oh. he was homeless for 40, for what, four decades. But look what his, his background is. He went to the, the most prestigious high school in the nation. advertising business for years, mm -hmm. the way this was set up, there was an impact statement in big 
the media statement did it. Like, it was done Perfect. so perfect. Like, it was marketable. Yeah, it was marketable. I'm like, wow. Like, this is how I do.